the White Hand Wovens Carries with Kristen. This month I am going to be featuring a TSC or a traditional sling carry two ways. This video is going to show it with a slip knot. Um, I can typically do this carry with a small baby with uh, two meters and I'm short so I can go all the way up to like 2.5 meters but if you're taller you can probably go a little bit longer than that without it dragging on the ground. So I'm using a 3.7 meter wrap just to show you how to do it. It is a light hand woven's Valkyria. So I find my middle marker and I put it on my back. I put one piece over my shoulder. So the shoulder that it goes over the baby will be on your opposite hip. Make sure that the piece across your back is not twisted. You're going to take it, accordion style it up, ensuring that your top rail isn't twisted. And then you're just going to readjust your shoulder a little bit. This carry is great for on the go because it's poppable. So baby likes to get in and out. If it's raining, it's super fast, snowing, things like that. So I'm just going to bring it up to my shoulder. Make sure this is still tight. Go over the active tail that's on my shoulder. Bloop. Under. And then you have this little pocket right here. And you're going to bring your tail up and through. And then I just, so your tail will be shorter than this. You just take it and drop it. And you're left with a tail going straight down and then a tail over here. So I take the tail that I've been looping around and I create a four. So I place it underneath my active tail. And I like to grab this tight because it makes helps to make a prettier slip knot. So when I take it underneath my active tail, I take my hand and I keep it and stick it through this little hole. And then I take the piece and you pull it into where your hand is. And then you just tighten up, make your knot look pretty. So then I take my knot, I move it up toward my shoulder. I push the knot down because I did not leave enough room to stick my baby in. I put my knot back up and I'm going to go grab my baby and just pop it right in. And looking at this, I actually think you'd be able to do it with a much longer wrap than I said. Maybe even up to a 2.8. So I'm going to readjust my knot. Pop Jane in. And this is just how you would put a baby into a ring sling. Put it, make sure your rail goes all the way up on baby's shoulders. Make a nice seat. Baby can keep their arms out or you can put it in. And then you want to fix your shoulder so it's comfortable. And then you're going to want to use your active tail, the one that's going straight down, to help tighten your slip knot and tighten up your carry. If your slip knot's still too low, can lift it up a little bit, especially with a really soapy wrap. Then you can pop. I jump up and down a little bit. And then. <laughs> Super easy carry. If she wanted to get out, I would just loosen up the slipknot. Just pop her out. Thanks, guys.